British Columbia can develop renewable energy that creates low carbon electricity without destroying wilderness ecosystems and critical wildlife habitat. But we need a comprehensive provincial energy plan and local governments and communities must be included in resource development decisions. We need real science and peer-reviewed studies that evaluate cumulative environmental impacts and we need to identify which development proposals have low environmental risks. Energy is British Columbia's last great resource. Any development of our energy resources should benefit the people of British Columbia, not just foreign corporate shareholders that are lined up to reap billions of dollars from BC Energy, our energy. Until now, BC Hydro's energy profits supported our social services, healthcare, education, and public infrastructure. As British Columbians, we stand to lose billions of dollars as our rivers are privatized. Citizens are speaking strongly against the massive river diversion projects proposed by Platonic Power and the US-based General Electric in the remote wilderness of Butte Inlet. This mega project is far from green. It would industrialize key grizzly bear habitat, as well as affect the streams and forests of the area on a drastic scale. These watersheds are only a few of more than 800 BC rivers threatened by private power projects. But Butte Inlet is beautiful BC at its best, rich in wildlife and ecotourism potential. Development of renewable energy should be where it is needed on an appropriate scale and in a way that best benefits the citizens of British Columbia. Let's give Butte a chance to be wild.